Hello crafty friends, it's Erica, Scrapdiva29. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys had a great weekend. I'm coming on today with a new fun finds video for you from AliExpress. I did get in some items. So I'm gonna jump in because I actually have a lot to share. So I'm gonna start with this adorable little flat back like cabochon set I found. As you can clearly see, it's a milk and cookies theme and we got some cute donuts and some really cute toast. I especially love the little milk jug with those little eyelashes. I mean, how adorable is that? Love it. Cannot wait to use these on a project. And then moving along, I did get in another bag of these sparkly bubblegum beads and they are pink and gold goodness. I mean, oh my gosh, they're so pretty. And um, I just cannot wait to pop these on a project and combine them with some other colors that I have. And so I just think these are so pretty. So I did get this huge bag and I wanna say this is probably a 12 millimeter size, but they're gorgeous and I'll definitely be sharing some of these. Um, moving along, I did get in these, um, these are snowflakes, snow, uh, die cut snowflakes and they are die cut out of felt. And they are so pretty and sparkly as you can see and they'd be so pretty just to add to your Christmas crafting. I know a lot of people are doing Christmas in July right now, um, so this would be perfect for your Christmas craft, so I can't wait to use these. So pretty, and I think I picked up some last year um, in a different color, but these are really fun to add to projects, and you can get, you, as you can see, you get a ton of snowflakes. And then moving along, um, I got these adorable little um, treat bags and they're all clear but I figured that these would be so much fun for like Halloween crafting or just any sweet treat themed project and as you can see they're like made out of clear um, I guess it's clear resin but then each one has like di different little bits inside like this one has little circles this one has stars this one has little hearts and then if you can see, they all have a little bit something different. They're stars, hearts, um, just all kinds of little itty bitty hearts. I mean, all of them are a little bit different, but how cute are those? So, so cute. You could totally pop these on a charm or this would be, you know, just so cute to add to anything. So, and I love that it says sweet and I really like the font. And you guys, you get a ton of them. You get a whole bag uh, of these little embellishments. So love these ones right here, adorable. And if you've been making any of those like little sweet, like keychains with little plastic goodie bag, this would be perfect for that as well. All right, I'm gonna slide those off to the side and move along. I did get in a bag of sequins and this is so pretty. It actually is just iridescent pink hearts. And I don't think I had anything like this in my stash, so I went ahead and grabbed a bag of these. Super pretty. And then I do have a few charms that I got in. These ones are so cute, and they are just mini, like, coffee cups or frappuccino cups with a tiny little heart, and they're pink and teal. And I just thought they were adorable, and I got a bag of them, probably a set of 10, maybe, or less. I'm not even sure how many you got in this little pack. Maybe six. It doesn't look that look like that many, I can't remember, but I just think those are so cute. So I got those in, and I'm just gonna slide those off to the side. And I did get in some cupcake charms, and these are so pretty. And the fact that they're purple and teal, and they have that bling on them, I mean, look how pretty that is. Aren't those gorgeous? Love these little cupcake charms, and again, you can always use these on a birthday project or any sweet treat themed project super super cute and i love the color combo so i got those and then moving along um i did get some more beads i got these little skull beads and they're pastel colors and i figured this would be fun for halloween crafting and as you can see you get a mix of colors purple pink yellow teal also like a cream color and there's like a like a light orange. So I just really like this mix of beads, so I grabbed those. And then moving along, I got these hearts in, and these are just like flat back resin hearts, and they kind of look like candy, and I just thought they'd be so cute to put on projects or even centers of bows. 
Um, I recently was gifted one of these little hearts in, by Angela and she had put a jump ring through the heart. Like she used the tool and put a jump ring through it, which I thought was really awesome. Or you could do a bail and pop it on that way. Or it could just be an embellishment. So I just thought these were really cute. They kind of look like little candy hearts. So I did get a little baggie of those. And there I got the variety color pack. But I believe you can pick out whatever colors you want. Moving along, these little itty bitty charms are so cute. Look how tiny they are. But they're little like candy bags and they have strawberries on the back. And then on the front, it reads sweet, if you can see that. I mean, they are itty bitty, but I just thought they were so cute. Um, so I did grab a bag of those. And then I have some Halloween charms that I got in. Um, I got these little spider webs in, and I thought these would be perfect for Halloween crafting, and they look like that with the gold and black. And I had some little ghosties that I got, but I can't find them, but... I will eventually and share, but I did get some ghosts in and I thought those were adorable. So I grabbed those and then moving along, I got some more charms and these ones are tiny little hearts and you get quite a few in this mix, but look how pretty those are. And they're just little flat hearts with gold around them. And I thought those were really, really pretty. And as you can see, you get black, pink, blue, I think those are, oh, you even get purple. There's a, several colors in this bag, as you can see. Aren't those gorgeous? And they're just itty bitty, they're tiny, but they're perfect to add to projects. So I love that little set right there. And then moving along, let me put those back in the bag. I don't wanna lose anything. I did get um, some dyes in. So I got this set right here and this is actually a paintbrush it looks like this then i also got this one as well this is a different style paintbrush and i just thought this would be so cute to decorate um, i actually did die cut out this one and this is what it looks like and i just thought how fun would that be to make some embellishments and i did use the wire wrap beads that i just recently got from angela who's love pink dragonflies and I'm so happy to be able to just pop some beads on a project anytime I get ready to. <laughs> I'm so happy with those beads. But how cute is that? Like you could totally layer the um, paint brushes like this, or you could just keep it separate, like a separate embellishment. And as you can see, I just add some rolled flowers, a little star sequence, and then I die cut out the word create. And you got a really cute little embellishment. And you could put this on a card for a crafty friend. Wouldn't that be so cute? Love that. Love that little die right there. And then moving along, I did get in some more charms. I've got these little bow charms that I got in. I thought they were really, really pretty. And I've already been seeing people use these on projects, so I'm not the only one. <laughs> but I thought they were super pretty, so I did grab those. And then moving along, um, I did get in the other set of tiny little bows. Um, I think last week I got in a couple colors, but this was the other set that I had also ordered. And as you can see, these are the itty bitty tiny bows and you get a variety of colors in this pack, pink, teal, hot pink, red, orange. So lots of different colors in this one. And I'd love that they're so itty bitty. They're just so cute. Um, and it came in this little container right here. And then moving along, what else do I have to share with you? Oh, I did get this in. This is a, I'm gonna zoom out so you guys can see. It's a little bow shelf. And I actually saw Nicole share this on her channel. And I thought it was so cute. I didn't realize it was so tiny, but I think it would be so perfect to hang like on a pegboard because it has these little hooks right here. And you could totally hang it on a pegboard and then put little goodies on it. And I just thought it was adorable. Um, this measures, let me just measure it really quick. It measures approximately seven and a half inches in the length and about, mm, I'm gonna say about five inches tall, um, just so you have a size reference. But look how cute it is. And I only ordered one and I'm now thinking I maybe should have ordered two. So I may go back and order it. And you know, you could always, if you didn't like the color, you could always go back and spray paint in another color if you didn't really like the color that it comes with. So that's just an idea. I thought that was adorable. And then last, or actually I have one more thing, two more things. I did get in my roll of uh, 
double-sided adhesive. This is the 1 8 inch. Um, I think I was telling you guys that I did order some, but I finally got it in. Um, so I'm happy to have this double-sided adhesive. It actually works really, really well. And then um, last but not least, I did get this purse. And I actually got it for my daughter. This purse is adorable, you guys. It's a, one of those little small purses with a chain, and then it has like a little tan strap. So you could definitely dress this purse up or dress it down. It would be perfect either way, but I think it was a cute little summer bag and I just picked it up for my daughter. I mean, it wasn't that expensive. I think it was under $18 and it's just a cute handbag and my daughter's in college and she doesn't need anything fancy, but you get plenty of room in here. Definitely throw your cell phone, makeup, that kind of stuff. You have room for all of that. And it just has this little lock right here and I just think it's cute. So I hope that she likes it. Um, I'm not sure if she's gonna like the color, but I felt like this color was neutral. It could probably go with lots of different outfits. So I did grab that. So that is my haul for today. I hope that you enjoyed my AliExpress haul. Check the description box below for the product information. And of course, if you have any questions, just ask. Thank you for stopping by my channel and I will catch you in my next video. Bye for now.